So, so, Gigi, yes, I can't wait to go through your wardrobe. When I see in the office at Vogue, you like, you strut around. I always love watching, seeing what you're going to wear. Something totally different on each day. It's part of the fun of coming into the office, you know, revealing the odd guilty purchase. Yeah. And so I want to just see it all in one place and talk to you. Let's go do it. Let's do it. Every day at the office, I will come yeah, in and work out. That's Saint Laurent bomber jacket. It's my favourite yeah. thing. This denim jumpsuit. That with a kind of a proper check. It's really smart. Do you remember what you wore on your first day at Vogue? A bright green dress. Quite 50s, but not fitted. And really a punchy shade of green. I just kind of just did my thing. Just went in, wore a red mohair sweater with some jeans and some black heels. Is there any pressure at Vogue to dress in a certain way? Do you know what, funnily enough, working at Vogue is a lot less intimidating than it was going to St. Martin's for the first time. We kind of rib each other a bit, don't we? Because we work so hard, I kind of think that I'm a bit more of a one-stop dresser. So that's why I love a tea dress. Just to say, I really loved your shoes on Thursday. How do you pick an outfit? It's very instinctual. Quickly. Really yes. quickly. See how you feel that day. But start with the shoes. Do anything. You can do anything with those. Do anything. You can do anything with those. I've got like five different pairs of shoes on at the moment. <laughs> what? My daytime, my nighttime. What are these? My wife and my mistress. Yeah. No, wait, this is it. This is it. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> my first like favourite pair of shoes. Where are sure. they? These ones. Uh, I would never have worn a shoe like this, but it was something about the way that Eddie did it for Saint Laurent. I just reconsidered it. Ooh, ooh. Quite pretty, huh? Very pretty. Yeah. These are a liar. So I'll Beautiful. wear these with like an oversized black t-shirt. First date boot. My night Cortez. How come they're in that purse box? Which is a limited edition. Are they? Yeah, these are Forrest Gump shoes. That, that's like a work shoe. <laughs> Princess shoes. God, they're beautiful. Aren't they heaven? But the only thing is, is that, I mean, they're completely impractical. You can't wear these outside. Car to carpet. But why? Because they just get wrecked. The Draw of Dreams. Oh my God, those jeans are great. These I got in Verona. Tattoo, Gucci tattoo, tattoo yeah. jeans. And they're a kick flare. Do you wear them? Oh yeah, I love that. Though that in the summer with just a white t-shirt. So purpose. good. This, these, these basically stop traffic. Ooh. It'd be rude not to have better more in your wardrobe right now. As <coughs> 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 uh, 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 <coughs> a case in point, we're gonna have a little better more on there. I think I might win. Where am I? I used to literally dance around. Louis Vuitton. Yeah, this this is one of my favourites. I love this. Kinky. I love it. A little bit. <laughs> this is Topshop, the collection that Kate Moss did. If I've got 10 minutes to get ready to a party, I'm wearing this. This is from a charity shop where I'm from in Surrey. It's sort of nothing. It's nothing. It's so nothing. wispy and ephemeral, but like you put a big long cashmere knit over that, that that hits here, something you've got this sort of beautiful yeah. wispy layer. Or even I wear it over trousers or something like it's, that. It's That's cool. vintage, cow neck. It sits in just the right place. But that in, um, you know, Ibiza, nice little pair of shorts. Going disco. Yeah, there's a lot of disco. I love things, you can probably guess, which catch the light, you know? I love, yeah, I've got a, like that kind of magpie thing. This is pretty badass. I Great. love this. That's and, Gucci. And I'd wear that with a black polo. So quite 60s, bit belle de jour. That, well, that was my school kilt. I can't believe I can actually still get that That's on. So funny. Although to be fair, it was about there on me. Got loads of check shirts. So that with my mum's from French Connection in the 70s. So mm. I put it with a painted skirt. Maybe dressing it up a little bit with a white go-go oh, boot. I've seen you wear those. Yeah. <laughs> They're major. Totally. Flip the dressing. That's what yeah. I do. I love that. I think it's great. That I bought at Glastonbury when I was 14. Glastonbury it's Festival. It's good. It's really nice. It's a, a lifetime of collecting. What item would you save in a fire? One item. I don't know, I try and save as many platform shoes as I can. But I just literally just do this. I'd be like Joey and Friends can't. and put a million Sorry. Seconds. This guy. Really? Yeah, because it would keep me warm. My mum's 70s jumpsuit. It's great. Yeah. Whenever I buy a coat, I always put it through this test of if you're wearing it on a, at a bus stop on like a rainy 
Monday night after work, would you feel good in it? I did happen to see this. Oh, yeah. That's a little, that's a little memento. This is little Naomi. It's kind of quite eccentric. My dad used to have a whole table. He would put me in that. He'd rip me out of bed at 6 a.m. and I would basically live with a jump seat. So I want to get it framed. I want to get it framed. Uh -huh. I know, I love this oh, guy. Gosh, tell me about this. This is like my second boyfriend, basically. Let go, let go. <laughs> every day. Every, Do you wear it every day? Every yeah. day. I love this guy because it feels kind of like an old school traveling case. I mean, it's classic. Oh, wow. Yeah. I will have that until I'm 90. Yeah. So, you know, it's about infiltrating the craziness with a bit of classic yeah. and then you're good to go. That's Santa on Betty. You just feel quite, quite fabulous with it. Yeah. It's quite a bit goldy horn. And just like this sort of gold strap. Yeah, I know, it's really glam. It literally is like, you know, have you seen that film Overboard with Goldie Horn? She starts go wearing all these like but horrible teachers. It's a sack. Isn't it, it is a bit of a sack. But when you belt it and you wear it with a little Dior situation, then, you know, it's really fun. I've got like three of the same pair of trousers in different sizes. I've got a Santa on pair, but I actually live in a cheaper pair that I get tailored on Savile Row. I, I feel like sometimes I'm a slave to my glossy vinyl trousers. <laughs> right now. What, can you hear me squeaking? It's, it's quite. <laughs> okay. Hi. Oh, no. Hi. Come on up. Hi. Hi. Come in. I love my wardrobe. We built the house about three years ago.